Sugar gliders can be unique and challenging pets. They have very specific nutritional requirements. They have very specific and uh, evolved needs for certain types of social behavior and social interaction. And also, they are nocturnal, meaning they exhibit most of their activity and most of their normal behaviors occur overnight when we're sleeping. So those are some of the considerations that people have to make before they decide if a sugar glider is the right pet for them. We find that most of the time, some of the difficulties in keeping sugar gliders do relate to um, concerns over proper feeding, proper care and husbandry, their requirements for a large enough cage for them to have enough exercise, enough space in the enclosure, enough time socializing with their human owners and with other sugar gliders, and then the ability to set up their home environment correctly definitely takes a strong commitment. We do feel that if people want a sugar glider, it's most important that they look into um, certain organizations, talk to breeders, discuss all the unique aspects of what a sugar glider would represent in their home, and then decide if it's the right pet for them. Overall, sugar gliders can be really amazing, very fun, interactive pets. Um, they may not be best with small children, but they definitely can make good pets if they're well socialized in the right type of home. Oh,